Hello, Inform Crows. I'm John from the Hot Informer, and today I'm going to talk about mobile new masks from Pumpkin Pulp for 2023. So the first mask I'm going to talk about in this video is called Grizzly, and this is creepy character of an old man, and he has all these wrinkles in his face, and he has this long beard, and he's got blood on his face, and cuts, and it's a really creepy character. So this mask has a movable jaw, and that's really nice, that definitely adds to the realism to it, so it's definitely going to be a great mask for your haunted attractions. You can use it in lots of places, have this creepy character appear all of a sudden, he could come out of a shack, he could come out of a creepy dungeon. There's just so many different places he could appear out of, and he's just unsettling. All of a sudden, you see this character, and it doesn't matter if you have a scare actor that is taller or medium-sized. I think this mask would be very intimidating either way, and just unsettling, and it just it's just like the name implies. It's grisly. It's gory, and this would be perfect with a costume that has a whole bunch of chunks of gore on it and splattered with permablood. That would look awesome. They might even be carrying around, like, prop organs, like you could get the... The silicone organs from the Sil Gibbs from CFX. You could get like a severed arm and or a heart and have him carrying around that or have prop intestines and act like he's going to put them on people. And it could be all kinds of possibilities for this. It could be very creepy and disturbing. The last mask I'm going to talk about in this video is called Barbecue, and Pumpkin Pulp Productions is known for their realistic looking animal masks, all kinds of different options for you, ranging from pigs to even an evil poodle called the Brutal Poodle. They have all kinds of awesome options, and this brand new barbecue mask is a barbecued pig, and it's completely black, and it's got cuts on its face, and of course this would be perfect for all your slaughterhouse areas. And it'd be just really creepy for those pig butchers, especially if you have an area where it looks like there are multiple animals that have been grilled on this grill and you have like fog effects coming out of it. Or you actually have a real grill and there's like flame effects coming out of it and that's like a startle scare that's to like the right of the people that could distract them. And then this character would come at them like a prop butcher knife or a giant cleaver and tries to cleave them and comes after them and could be making pig noises and snorting at them and you could make all kinds of really disturbing characters with this you could have them have the apron on splattered with blood and you could have chunks of gore on there as well so you could have all kinds of fun with this and of course going with the burn theme you would have the whole character look like they were burned so the whole costume would be burned as well so this would be a very disturbing character or you could have an effect where it looks like there's a grill and then this character actually appears out of it. Like the grill is like the ploy and there's like props on top of it so it looks like there's mobile burned animals on the grill and then the actor has a latch under it and can pull it up and that character lunges out of it. So like the grill is the scare spot. So you could have all kinds of great fun with this. Another way you could use this mask is when you're going through a slaughterhouse area, like a butcher shop area of your haunted attraction, and you have multiple slabs of meat that you're walking through, and you could pump in that burn charred smell of meat. You could have that from Froggy's Fog, that burn smell, and then you're walking through that, and you have to push through the slabs, and all of a sudden this character starts coming after you, and that could be just one of the characters, and there's multiple different fog effects that you can get, like the pocket foggers from Froggy's Fog, and you could have that on the scare actor, so it looks like they're steaming as well, so you could have all kinds of great stuff with this, and the scare actor could spray smell effects on themselves, the smell bad, so you could do all kinds of crazy things with this character. That was the Haunt Informer. I hope you enjoyed. Subscribe and hit that bell icon so you get a notification every single time I put up a new video. Give this video a thumbs up and share with your friends. And I am on social media. I am on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. You can find all those links below. And tell me about which mask you like the most in this video. And as always, happy hauntings.